guys, this is your girl Letitia Charisma and this is my channel, DK Squad. If you are new here, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and the sub button. And today we're gonna be doing our collab on Outrace's newest collabs for April 2024 with Miss Courtney Janine. So what's up, Court Crew? Go ahead and show me some love in the comments down below, you guys. We went ahead and split these units up because there were 20 in total. I'm gonna do, I think, seven on my video. And um, I'm not for sure how many Courtney's going to do. But so far, we're the only two like wig, um, wig influencers that do these videos. I started this about three years ago and then Courtney followed. And I just love the fact that when she started doing the videos that she gave me like a shout out because that meant so much to me. You know, I really work hard on these videos and for her to like shout me out. You know, hey, a sister's here to inspire, honey. So um, I was so excited when we decided to collab on this together. I have a good time with Courtney on Instagram uh, chat. We, we, yeah, we have issues, girl. We be on there kiki -ing. But anywho, let's go ahead and jump right into this, girls. So the first one we're gonna talk about is Miss Alika. This is from the Lace Front series, I believe. And remember with Lace Front series, it's always really affordable. So that's like a really good thing. And they've been stepping up their game on the Lace Fronts. This is an absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous unit. Um, it Like the color schemes are beautiful. 26 inches in length, yakky texture, wavy style. Ginger Copper and Terra Mizu, hopefully I'm saying it right, are the colors that are shown, you guys. And with Lace Front Series wigs, it's not really about like the lace. Like these aren't frontals or anything like that. I love these because for me, they're like pretty much thrown and goes, but they're really styled great. Like they don't look like they're like $25, $26 wigs. So I'm definitely going to be reviewing this and I really think I'm going to uh, review it in both of the colors shown. It should, that ginger copper just looks so fun, right? It looks so fun. So yeah, we gonna keep our eyes out for Miss Alika. Let me know in the comments down below what you're thinking and are you going to pick her up as well? Okay, so next up we have the HHB, which is Human Hair Blend, Natural Yaki, 22 inch, five by five lace closure. This is a 22 inch unit. The style is gonna be straight. Colors shown are cocoa caramel, ginger, and strawberry goat. This is definitely a winner. I think I'm like addicted to these units now. I didn't even used to like these things because me and Closures, we're friends, but when it comes to like melting that mess down and doing all that, you know, like I said, if you new here, Court Crew, I'm a lazy girl, okay? I'm 47, I'm old, I don't be feeling like melting and all that good jazz unless it's worth it. And with the um, five by five, the last one I reviewed was so beautiful. So beautiful and it melted really, really well. So I definitely want to review this. Now I'm gonna show you guys something. That color, uh, I believe, I, is this the, I don't know what color this one is. Let me see. Not, it can't, is it, that's not strawberry gold. Girl, where that, where's that color? It don't even say, I think this is the D, the DR2 Honey Brown. You see the style there? So back in the 90s, that was called a wrap. And how you guys like wrap your hair up at night now and then when you take off your little bonnet or whatever and it just kind of falls, that's what we were doing in the 90s. Like we were just wrapping our hair with wrap lotion, right? And this is the style that it would come out to. I literally had my hair like this for my 12th grade graduation photo in 1994. That tells you how old I am. But anywho, I love the style. I love the bangs. It's absolutely gorgeous. I really think Courtney may review this as well because she's a bang girl. But I just love the fact that it's a five by five closure and you can do so many different styles with it. So I really do want to review this probably in the cocoa caramel color. Every style that they're showing on these photos is just amazing. And once again, Outre does so well with like the color blends. Everything looks so natural. Everything like gels so well with women, uh, women of color, especially with those color blends. So I'm definitely going to keep my eye out for the Yaki, but heads up. Um, the 5 by 5s are expensive. Like the last one I bought was 70 bucks. And y'all know I'm El Cheapo. I don't like spending no lots of money, girl. But the last one I bought was worth it. So I may just dive in and like splurge a little bit for this especially because it's a closure. So yeah, let me know what you're thinking and if you wanna see me review her and if you're gonna be picking her up as well. So next from the Everywhere collection, we have the Every 38, 24 inches in length, wavy style. Lace type is gonna be a lace front color shown. DR Red Velvet and DR FF4 slash Neapolitan Swirl. Oh my goodness, the color. 
the Neapolitan. It just makes me want to like eat it. Like, oh my God, girl, that's cute. So with the Every 38, well, excuse me, the uh, Lace Front Everywhere series, very hit or miss. Lately, they've been hitting. Like I, I had, I just reviewed like two of them, I think last month and they were gorgeous. Like everything was like really nice about the unit. Texture, density, all that. But you have to really decipher if you want to purchase one or not. But the great thing is, once again, these are really affordable. So you're not gonna break the bank if you decide to jump in and buy one and then it's like a miss. Uh, you'll be out like maybe 25 bucks. So I, I, don't, I don't think I'm gonna review this one, but I think that Neapolitan swirl color is it. That is so pretty. It literally looks like an ice cream sandwich on her head. Like, girl, that's cute. That's cute. Let me know what you guys are thinking and if you want to pick her up. Okay, so next up we have the Swoop 7 from the uh, Swoop uh, the Swoop series. So this is a 28 inch unit, yakky texture, curly style, deep sea lace part, lace front, color shown 1B in honeycomb blonde. So I think I'm gonna skip this one, but I do think it's really gorgeous. I I think I've only, re I haven't reviewed any swoops, I don't think, have I? I think I reviewed one. They, they, they just don't gel with me and that's fine. You know, we all have different opinions and what we like and what we don't like. I do like the color, but the style is just, it just looks like it's a little bit too much hair coming, um, coming up here at the front. There's not enough layers and it just looks very heavy, very dense filled at the top of the crown there. So I may not review it, other wig mates, other wig bays may review it and I'll just go ahead and watch their reviews. But for me, I'm definitely gonna pass on Swoop 7. Let me know down below what you guys are thinking and if you're gonna perk her up or not. Okay guys, so next up we have Aluna. This is from the Lace Front Sleek Lake Part Series. I love the Sleek Lace. 16 inches in length, um, yakky texture, wavy style, flat lace part, color shown rich red and soft blonde. So Aluna looks like she's been done before. Very gorgeous, I think she's really pretty. Once again, a little top heavy there with the density. Kind of looks like it just sits on your head there. But with Sleek Lace, supposedly they are really flat to the scalp. Most of the ones I reviewed have been. So maybe a Luna will be this way as well. Looks like you're gonna have to take maybe a, um, a flat iron or a hot comb just to make sure that that lays flat. Nonetheless, I think this is a gorgeous unit. On the fence about reviewing her, let me know in the comments down below what you're thinking and if I or you are gonna be picking Miss Luna up. Okay guys, also from the Sleek Lay Part Series, we have Sahari, 26 inches in length, yakky style, well yakky texture, wavy style, lay, uh, flat lace part, 3DR FF Ember Blonde and DR FF6 Terry Muzu. So this is from the Blonde Series. Love when they do the Blonde Series with Sleek Lays because that 3DR FF Ember Blonde eats. It eats. So I do love the style of Sahari, even though it does look like the layers are really long on her. And that's gonna be kind of on the fence for me because I have a smaller sized face, like an oval shaped face. And I love when wigs kind of open my face up. So when there's really long layers and they look like that, I'm not like too sure. But it does look like um, this is gonna be a right side part unit. So I probably will be able to work with her. If I do review this, I definitely wanna review it in the 3DR FF Amber Blonde color. That color is so good for summer, you guys. Like, I have a lot of sleek lay parts in the Amber Blonde color. And it's so gorgeous. It brings out your complexion. It's so pretty. So I'm definitely gonna keep my eye on Sahari. We'll see because it also looks like it, it could be a tangly unit as well. Just how the curls are shaped or whatever. Oh my God, every time I film, I swear to God, these men come and start cleaning and doing yard work behind me. But anywho, yeah, this is pretty, you guys. Let me know down below what you're thinking of Sahari and if you want me to review her as well. Hey guys, that's pretty much it for this review. If you enjoyed my content today, don't forget to hit the thumbs up button. Also follow me on TikTok and Instagram at Letitia Charisma for more beauty and hair related content. I will see you guys in the next video. Stay beautiful and blessed as always. Bye.